Kids say the darndest things, especially when you're least expecting it, so here we've gathered some more of the creepiest things ever. When my son was three, he started singing a Polish nursery rhyme that my husband's grandmother used to sing all the babies in the family. She passed away before my son was born, and we don't speak or sing Polish. My daughter was about five when she says, You're the best mummy I've ever had. I said, I'm the only mummy you've ever had. She looks at me and says, No, you're the third one, but I like you the best. Hmm. I was hiking alone in the woods with my son, who was seven. It was eerie quiet. Out of nowhere, he says, The woods demand a sacrifice. We're all going to die. I know, sweetie, that's just part of... You're going to die tomorrow. When my niece was seven, she asked why we were keeping all the dead grandmas in the attic. Then she laughed. Putting my half-brother down for a nap, he goes, I can't sleep with that mean little boy staring at me, points to dark closet. We decided to go to the beach instead. Can I marry you? No, sorry, sweetie, I have a boyfriend. The five-year-old thinks for a second. What if he died? At the store, he suddenly grabs my hand, squeezes real hard and says, Mama, when you die, I'm going to make a little you so I can keep you always. Like with your skin and eyes, but probably not your insides. Woke up in the dead of night in total darkness. Thought someone had called for me, but all was quiet. Didn't notice that my three-year-old had crept in and was standing beside my bed until he whispered into my ear, I used to have a train set when I was a grandpa. Mama, what happens to us when we die? Oh, um, well... Oh, never mind, I remember, we become new again. She smiles and walks away. I woke up to three-year-old kid number four petting my head. I asked what she needed and she mm -hmm. said, I wish I had a piece of you that I could carry with me all the time, like your finger. I haven't slept soundly since. My son at five years old. Daddy, I'm going to eat you up. Aww. Yeah, I'm going to cut you into little pieces. Oh my god. When I was about 16, I was in a grocery store with my mum and a tiny child I had never seen before suddenly latched himself around my leg. He wouldn't let go, kept insisting I was his first mummy. He sobbed when pried off by his actual mother. Bizarre. When my twins were born, one of them took longer to talk. When she did start, it was in fluent Spanish, which we don't speak at home, nor does anyone who had come into contact with. 